Hey, it's Chris from Hunter here. And in today's specification spotlight, we're gonna talk about the difference between flow meters and flow sensors. Now, both devices send information to the controller. This is the Hunter HC Flow. This is an inch and a half flow meter that can send information to the controller and it has a dial on the actual meter itself. So you can always open the valve box and see how much water you used. You'll also see a little leak indicator. Now that's a little tattletale that will tell you if you have a, a slow leak or a low flow in your main line. Now, these devices are handy because even if you don't have a flow sensing controller, they can still be used as an irrigation submeter. So you don't need to have a connection to the controller. Now flow sensors are devices that actually monitor the flow and the water traveling through the main line. So these are typically also back at the point of connection. And a Hunter HFS or flow sink is a paddle wheel style sensor. Now as the little paddle wheel moves, it measures the water and sends data back to the controller for how many gallons a minute are going through your main line. Now, to take it a step further, ultrasonic flow sensors also fit into your main line, but they have a ultrasonic eyeball in there. That measures the flow at a higher degree of accuracy. So it gives you a wider range of flow. So let's say you have low flow drip zones or barely a gallon a minute, or and you need to be able to manage your total main line flow, which could be upwards of 50 to 100 gallons a minute. So these give you a little wider range and they also work great with Hunter compatible controllers such as the ACC2. So that's our spec spotlight for today. Thanks for tuning in.